everybody, welcome back to my world where no matter how old you get, you never need to grow up. And I'm always so excited, right? I'm always like, and today I'm so excited because, but I am excited. I'm so excited that I'm, I rushed to do this video this morning. I was like, it's, I, I did walk. I was a good girl. I have walked every day this weekend, this week, this weekend, every day, all two days. No, it's the week. It's Friday. I walked every day this week. Go me. Taking care of my cardiac health, you know, but I'm so excited. I walked and then I jumped in the shower and then I threw some makeup on and I'm going to go see my mom. But before I do that, I have to show you that I have the new Barbie Extra Minis. So there's a bunch of these coming out. Okay, they're super, super, super cute. You know I love me some Barbie Extra Minis, but those are $16.99, okay? But they also came out with Barbie Extra Mini Minis. <laughs> they're Mini Minis. So, so this is a Mini, this is a Mini Mini. <laughs> In love. <laughs> I, I think what they're just trying to do is they're just trying to shrink Barbie down to Polly Pocket size, <laughs> but they're taking us there slowly. It's like how you boil a frog, you put it in a pot of cold water with the flame underneath it, and then it slowly gets warmer and doesn't realize that it's being cooked. That's what they're doing. They're shrinking a Barbie. They're crushing her head. They're shrinking Barbie, and I think it's really cute. So, so I am so, so psyched to open these and I can't find any glasses. Here we go, there's some glasses. I found some glasses. Oh, there you are, there I am, there everybody is. Um, let's start, let's do the minis and then we'll do the mini minis. These are super, super cute. Look at the artwork on her. I mean, the artwork is really fun. It's almost got a caricature vibe to it. And I will say that it doesn't really reflect what the doll actually looks like, you know, because here she's got that big smile. I wish she would have had more of a pout like she has here. I don't think I would like the big smile on the face. So that's why I'm saying I would want it to go in that direction. These are, pro um, these are for ages three and up because, you know, small parts, you know, you could choke, you choke. Um, I just think these are so cute. Parents, grandparents, aunts, uncles, cool people who buy dolls for kids and themselves. Look, it's the collectors. I mean, I know kids Kids are going to love these. So I would definitely say stock up on these. These would be, I was going to say stocking stuffers, but it's $16.99. I don't know that that's a stocking stuffer. But the minis, the mini minis, which I think it's so funny that they went mini mini. Um, I think those would be good, be good stocking stuffers. These are just really good dolls, honestly. They're a really nice size and they also come with a stand, which blows my mind because we don't get stands with any of the other regular Barbie Playline stuff. So like even the extras, but the Barbie extra minis come with a stand. And it's actually a really cute stand that goes together well, too. So there's lots to recommend, the Barbie Extra Minis. And, uh, I mean, $16.99, they're more than a fashionista, but they're also fully articulated. They're really cute. So here's her little stand, and it's red, to go with her cool outfit. Now, as always, I don't like doll glasses or sunglasses. Well, I like glasses, but not sunglasses. But these are cool. These are very cool. Very, very cool. Go. Oh, look at her! So she's got like a monster truck vibe going. And this is the cutest. She's got a monster truck purse. I do not think I have ever seen a Barbie with a monster truck accessory. Has there even been a monster truck Barbie? Because I know there's been like NASCAR Barbie, probably Formula One Barbie. This doll, oh. Oh my gosh, her hair is really nice, by the way. I mean, the kajinkers are still sticking out of it. This hair is really nice. A little, a little bit tacky feeling, but it's really fun. This is really, really cute hair. Fun, they could do stuff with it. You could style it. There's her face. And of course it's screen printed. I mean, you know, we're not, this is, this is, this is not a high end. I mean, look, at this point, even the collector dolls, everything is just pixelated and screen printed. She's got these like flame earrings. Whoops. Look at her little beauty mark. And I love the juxtaposition of the pink lips with the orange and the red. 
Um, I don't generally like, you've heard me say it a million times, that I don't like pink and orange together. I think you guys are just getting me used to it. Loving the little flame dress. Look at this cool jacket. Look at this cool girl jacket. She's got this cool girl studded. Of course, those are not real studs. It's just screened on. But this cool girl studded crop leather jacket vibe going over this awesome flame skirt with this cute belt. Oops, sorry, I just almost pulled your cute belt off there. It's okay, it's all right. I'm all right, I'm good. And the belt, like, it, it's like made to look like it's also studded. So she's a very cool girl. And then she's got her studded bracelet and little fishnets. <laughs> If they put fishnets on the mini minis, I'm going to crack up. Um, her little fishnets, so cute. And what is going on? Oh, her seam is like totally crooked, though. Got to put that seam around the back, girl. Learn how to wear some fishnets. There we go. Mm, okay. And then like, you know, her little Doc Martens. She's so cute. Now, the, the reason these dolls are $16.99 is the articulation. They are articulated at their elbows and knees, not at the wrists. Um, good uh, flexibility and movement in the shoulders. Uh, but I mean, being able to bend their knees, like, and not just, you know, pop knees, but like really bend their knees, just makes them so poseable and fun. And then their fashions are a little bit you know, a little bit more, you know, than, I guess, you know, like a Chelsea. Are they Chelsea size? Yeah, kind of, kind of, but their proportions are different. Um, their heads are different. I expect you could probably get some Chelsea clothes on them and vice versa. I don't, right at this moment in time, have a Chelsea handy. You're probably looking behind me right now going, she lying? Is there a Chelsea up there? I can't see. It's blurry. I'm trying to get her waist hugger on. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Come on. But I mean, she's got a stand. I don't know. Maybe that shouldn't have been pink. Maybe it would have been cooler if it was black with like the pink monster truck sticker on it. I don't know. What do you think? What do you think? I think she's really, really cool. And then, oh, and then um, there's this one and the two mini minis. I am going to pause to get all of this out of the box. Also, I need to make more tea. And uh, and then we will return with everything else out of the box and, and we will talk about the mini minis and the extra mini and how cute they are. I'll be right back. Okay, the cuteness is completely out of control. I can't even, I can't, I, I, I am just, I love Barbie extra minis. And in case you're wondering, is she really meaning that? I don't know. So if you make it to the back shelf after I review you, it means I liked you like a lot. Okay. And I tend not to buy things that I don't think I'm going to like. Every once in a while I do because I want to see. And then, you know, I'm like, mm, 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 mm. but yeah, there's, there's one up there. There's, there's, there's one over here. You know, that's a Dream Ella Mini. There's one up there. There's a couple of them around here. There's one over there. There's one over there. Yeah, I mean, I think all of the ones that I got in the first round, yep, are, are out here. So really not joking when I say this. I love them. Okay, so before we get to the mini minis, which if you saw my Instagram, you know, I'm just like, I can't fr even with these. Um, okay, look at this princess. Look at her. Okay, she's in her packaging. She's got the coat on the one arm thing. <laughs> I mean, the attitude. And I think I said this, I think we did have this discussion with the first round of the minis that I was like, they're just giving so much attitude in such a tiny little package. Like there is so much attitude in like the coats on the one on the one shoulder. It's very kind of breakfast at Tiffany's, but obviously not the same colors. We've got pink streaked brown hair, really pretty brunette hair, really love the color. The texture on this is a little bit better than the other one. Um, love the top knots. I, you know, mm, not really, you know, me and the glasses, but I'm about to contradict myself on the whole glasses thing in a second. She comes with a yellow stand. I'm going to take her off her yellow stand so we could just oh, see her a little bit better. I mean, $16.99 and they come with little teeny tiny stands, which is awesome because they are small. And so displaying them is, look at her little, it's like a toki doki, like 
Do you remember the, um, what were they? They weren't moonicorns. What were they? They were, it was moo. It was something about moo and tokidoki and they came in milk boxes. Like, I feel like that's what this is, this is doing here. And then, so she's got this fluffy pink coat, which is surprisingly soft. And I think I said this about the last, wherever she is, where are the, oh, I think they're on my desk. The other, the two other uh, Barbie, actually, no, I didn't open them. It was something else. I don't know. It's early in the morning. I'm still working on the caffeine. But I did do something else recently that had fur that felt really good that I was surprised because it was a Barbie thing. Um, and look at her pearl necklace. Huh? And look at those bold brows. Look at this, just this attitude. I am in the process right now of rewatching uh, Gossip Girl. So I'm getting like a more mature Blair Waldorf here. But there's definitely like a little bit of a breakfast at Tiffany's. Just a like a 60s type of um, mod. That's what I'm going for. There's definitely a mod feeling here. So we've got the articulated knees. Like, look, just look like you can do that, right? And let's turn her head. Look, she's got the little leg kicked back, right? And she's just like, oh, look at the little, these boots are made for walking, little cowboy boots. And her dress is just a very, very simple sheath dress in a classic blue color with a pretty classic kind of pattern to it. Um, she's got a gold bra bracelet, pearl earrings. Oh, oh, I love her. I love her. I love her. I'm emotionally involved with her. Speaking of emotionally involved with things. So Taylor Swift right now, as I am filming this, is occupying all of the spaces in the uh, top 10 on Billboard's top 10. And I think that's based on, you know, downloads and listens, and I don't know what they base that stuff on nowadays. And uh, so I was like, well, I should probably listen to the album. I mean, you know, I liked, you know, I like I like a lot of her stuff and check out, because it's very popular, check it out. And I'm listening to it. I do love Antihero just because I think that's a really, it's a cool song. But And I'm listening to it and I'm realizing that I understand why it is so popular, but I also understand that in less than a month I'm turning 55 and so much of what she's talking about, I'm just like, yeah, that would have been me like 35 years ago or 40 years ago even. Um, and so I just thought that was really like, I don't feel old. I feel wise. <laughs> no, I don't feel wise. I just, it was, it was very, I'm gonna tell you, as you start to get into your fifties, you really do start to feel your age. Not just in the fact that your knees are like every morning, your knees are like, what the fuck? But, um, <laughs> just and and you you think you you get that joke until it happens to you and like for no reason whatsoever your knees just stop being good um anyway so i was just really struck by how further out of the pop culture i am you know pretty soon i'm gonna start getting this like put in curlers on fridays and you know then sprayed completely to my head and only wash it once a week at the beauty parlor never gonna happen. I do need a haircut though. Look at this. So this is a Barbie extra mini mini. So she's a mini mini. This is a mini. This is a mini. This is a mini mini. <laughs> this is your brain on mini. This is your brain on mini mini. It also comes with stands. So for $6.99 you're getting a super adorable little fashion doll. <laughs> She's got really cute hair. These are definitely stocking stuffers for doll lovers of all ages. This is my exception to I don't like glasses. Her little cloud glasses. Love them. Look at the size of the earrings. They're like almost the size of her freaking head. I am going to take off her glasses though so you can see her unbelievable face. Does this little mini mini give good face or what? I love the lighter brow, right? Because we've got this like, you know, multicolored little, little shaggy long hair do going here. It's very cute. And she's got the lighter brow, but that really bold eyeliner. Love it. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. It's just like, again, with the attitude. Now, these dolls are not articulated in the elbows or knees. Okay, so that's the 
other than the scale, they are not articulated at that depth. She's wearing roller skates, which is really, really cute. You know me, I love doll at roller skates. Um, and she's got this little barrel purse here and I just want to pick up her hair, which means I'm probably going to drop the purse. And just so you can see, she's got this little sheer net jacket, but it's finished off. It's finished off. And then this cute little, is this, a, is this, uh, uh, it's a strapless. Like even the camera's having trouble like focusing on it. She's got this little strapless dress with this little like tennis skirt and these roller skates. She's so cute. She's adorable. I just can't get over how cute these are. Oh my God, please keep making them. And just, and, and Mattel, can you just please keep trying to scale them down smaller and smaller yet still make them really cute fashion dolls with fabric clothes? I want to see how small you can get on the fabric clothes. Like at what point are these going to have to turn into rubber Polly Pocket clothes is what I'm wondering. Oh my God, I love her so much. Okay, are you ready? Are you ready for the pièce de résistance? Are you ready? <laughs> All the attitude. Ah! Look at her. Look at that graphic eyeliner. Those lashes that they painted on there. Look at this face. Look at that facial mold. Oh my gosh, the cheeks and like the deep dimples on the sides of the lips. So cute. Uh, these gigantic hoop earrings, right? This super frilly dress is so cute. Her hair is like a burgundy, like a burgundy high pony. I'm keeping these glasses up here. They're kajinkered up there. I'm keeping them there because I think they just look kind of really cute. Um, it's interesting that none of her accessories match her. She's got purple glasses, gold earrings, a pink purse and white shoes. And you know what? There are no effing rules. And then look at the ruffled ruffles and polka dots. You have me at ruffles and polka dots. Look at her little purse. So cute. So cute. There it is. I got it going backwards. It's a bow. I have it on backwards. Sorry. <laughs> Hashtag so profesh. Excuse me. I need to go get the doll. You can drop an accessory over the edge, but you drop the doll over the edge and you really don't have much more you can say at that point. Okay. I have Barbie cutie reveals over here. I have the smelly, smelly, the scented Barbie um, color reveals. I have so much Barbie stuff to do for you, but I have to go see my mommy. You guys go see my mommy. Go spend time with my mama because I love her. Um, so I might not film until tomorrow. So, but I will just, look at the little sneakers. She's so cute. She's so cute. And her stand, these are what their stands look like. Um, hers is blue. It got, it's kind of almost the same color as her, um, as her sunglasses, yet not. <laughs> and I'm wondering if like all of the, the accessories are so big because they didn't mold smaller accessories. They were like, no, no we're just going to put the big ones. We're just going to put the Barbie size ones on them. It'll be great. It'll be so cute. So these are the Barbie extra mini minis. These are my first two of these and I love them. And then this is, these are the Barbie extra minis. And I, I could not possibly could not love them more. The only way I could love them more, I think, is if the mini minis were articulated, which would be nuts. <laughs> but that would probably be the only thing that could make me be like, oh my gosh, love them more. I think they are so cute. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of them. Highly recommend the mini minis as stocking stuffers for the holidays. Um, and just, I think these are really, really cute. I think they're good travel size dolls. I think you can throw a bunch of them into a small container in the car with your kids or on the airplane if you're traveling for the holidays. So I really do think that these are a great value and there's lots of play value and changing fashions and all that stuff, but in a very small package, which, which I think is really, really uh, clever and adorable. Anytime you can make it small, I love it. So can't wait to hear what you all think. And thank you so much for watching. I'm gonna go see my mommy. Love you, bye.